here we are going to assemble our MTK 9.5 night sights. These fit the Caltech PF9. Um, should receive a package like this, which is going to have your night sights in it. And we want to work over a tray with sides, uh, preferably dark in color. These things are small, they have a tendency to roll away. So whoever you've ordered your uh, tritium from, most likely will come in a container like that uh, with cotton in it. <clears throat> I've already took the cotton out. So there we have them. Uh, these night sights have uh, some pre-drilled holes on the bottom. This is to uh, relieve any uh, glue that gets in the back so it has a place to go as you insert the uh, your tritium vials. <clears throat> and the uh, process is really simple. You want to make sure you have nothing down in your holes, burrs or anything. I use a little paper clip. Uh, make sure there, there's nothing going to be in your way. Once you get these vials in there, <clears throat> there's no getting them back out. A uh, little piece of cardboard. And I use a toothpick to put some in the hole. This stuff seems to tack up really fast. So you want to put a ball in there and work with it. <clears throat> now you don't have to worry about too much excessive glue on the outside. It all cleans up rather well. And actually, if you the more the better almost so to speak with the excess of glue it gives you the ability to grab it with your fingernail and pull it off if you uh, work with just try to clean it up ahead of time when you're working with just residue uh, it definitely doesn't clean up near as easily uh, it's just it's hard to get a hold of uh, I can generally clean it up mostly with a uh, fingernail sometimes I use a uh, pencil eraser a little bit it sticks to the housing gets like rubber cement almost but it does pull off rather easy it will clean free so I know it's hard to see but you put the tritium vial in there and then I use the other side of the, the toothpick now you only want to push these in flush no more sometimes they'll They'll want to try to pop back out on you a little bit, which is okay because if you push it and hold it, then that glue will start to come out the hole a little bit. But there we go. There's we got that one. They're small. They take a little bit of getting used to. Different people handle them different ways. Some people just can't get a hold of them. But anyhow, I'm going to push them back in, just flush. I don't want to go any more than flush. If you go too far with them, it actually will take away from the quality of the night sight and the daytime viewing as well. And uh, these look pretty good. Now tomorrow, <clears throat> I'll just come through, let this dry really good, and I'll come walk around it with my fingernail and I'll just start to pull off all that excess of adhesive and uh, you're pretty much good to go. Thanks for watching.